G'day everyone, Raid Zero AU, and welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival in Alpha 6. This is episode number 18, and we are in the process of doing our generator room, or generator building. So as I said at the end of the last video, I've, all I've done is I've just uh, built these things up. have done a couple of other things uh, off camera. Did a bit more scouting around, haven't found any more points of interest to uh, to go and check out. So really it's just left us with the drone base and the abandoned mine. Uh, might have to hit up the abandoned mine, um, see how we go there. Um, also made a couple of tier 2 auto mining uh, devices and placed those out on a couple of Prometheum deposits. One there and one over there. So they can be mining away, uh, just uh, gathering a bit of energy. But, so I've just built up the, uh, the walls on the sides here for this. And let's throw some blocks in here. And so now, I reckon what we want to be doing is building this in. Start, starting to bring it in. Be able to bring that over. Oh, that's okay. Should be able to put one just there. Maybe not. All right, might have to put a block there for a second and maybe a block there for a second and then should be able to bring those over like that now question is if I remove these it should be all right because it's got the um, top of the generator to hold it it's okay we can worry about shaping inside afterwards. Alright, let's do the same on this side. And over. We possibly could have brought them up one more on the sides. One shouldn't be so much of an issue, I wouldn't have thought, but we'll wait and see. Because I should be able to just and of course this is where we need to look at the corners. Knock 
Okay. So, this one here, we need one of these, I reckon. There. Just be able to use. No, it's going to need to be one of those large ones like that to fill that bit in. And then this one here is those. Like that. Just fill those ones in. Use the long corner. No, that's completely wrong. Let's try that again. That's better. And there. that in. Now this one here, just here, these can be they just be closed off like that. But what we then want to do is we do want to start bringing these in. So two two That should do it. And then it's probably these ones again, isn't it? That's be able to do is bring these in to a point like so. Okay, so let's go to our texture tool and I think we do the same. In fact, we do it to the whole block. Do we want to do it? That doesn't work. If we do that. Alright. That can just stay like that. And apply the whole block. That. So if that turns off, not that we can see it from here anyway, but uh, let's it should turn the base off. So at night you'd be able to see that, but during the day you can't quite see it. That's okay. And then what we'll do is use some of these. Yeah, 
are we looking at here? One, two, three, four, five, six. So. There. And on this side, we got one, two. Yep, same again. And the same again on this side. So. Far away. On there. Back on there. All right. At this point, we can probably come out here. <laughs> and what we want to do is we want to place. These ones. Now, sometimes when it gets to these lower ones, it's just easier to use the drain because you can get down lower. Unfortunately, there's no crouch available. A matter of can you get low enough to be able to actually hook that in to the bottom there yep because we want those going into the ground Let's see how we go on this side yep no problem probably take these corners out take that corner out and stick that in just to so it's not quite so square texture tool what we then want to do we'll apply to the whole block and I reckon it's this one here it's the one we want yep just to give it that piping look
Now, next thing we need to do is we need to really link it up to our main base so that we have access to it. And I'm thinking the easiest way to do this is to actually make a walkway. Walkway slope, walkway. Possibly make it. You know, we will have to move this, uh, the um, health one, uh, the medical station back. Uh, we need to bring that down one. The other thing we're going to need to do this is we got any in there? No. We've got some more walkways, but we're going to need probably some truss blocks. Not huge amounts, but we're going to need a few just to support. Starters. Right here. All right. So if we come back here, way slope, way slope two. So it matches up. Come down like that. Oop. And then that could hooks up. Like so, and then if we just get rid of those, just come in, and we can use that. as support. can come along here Probably need to put some more support in here. So we've got a little bit of support just for structural integrity purposes. It's across there. I'm going for uh, that we can pick up for the moment. There. Where are we going here? All right. One more. There. And then we'll put the uh, truss blocks down again. Put a full line this time for support.
And that can just come over like that. Alright. Just fill this in. All right, so that gives us access then into here. We've got to be careful in here because obviously uh, this is probably going to get quite hot in here. That's okay. And then what will happen is uh, we will have further branches going off to. In fact, I probably don't need to. When I was saying I need to move that back, I probably don't need to. Basically, I just make the entrance here. And it all comes off this central walkway. It probably makes more sense. Someone lines up with that. We might as well keep putting these in. Whoop. Oh. Oh. Managed to go and stick on somewhere, but not sure where it went. Just come over there. Like that. And then this one here, that was a truss block there. We've only got two of those left, so... Okay. That works. We've got that. Everything's a bit plain at the moment. We do need to do the... Uh, do the shaping on it. Uh, not the shaping on it, the um, texturing on it. Um, just thinking, we probably would have that open like that. give us access if we go outside that one. Uh, we've got a few more of those. We need just a few more of that. Oh no, no we don't. We've got heaps of them. Thought we'd almost run out. Oh well, make another 20. Won't go astray. And I'm thinking what we then would do here. Yeah, it depends. We may not be able to do this. Won't let, probably won't let us put them in. And it's going to let me put no no it's not going to let me do that oh well in that case what we do is we will put that there we'll probably take that one out as well No, that looks weird if I leave it like that, just because it's not. And put one in 
Ne. Which means we'll need another one there. And we will need another one there. Just to even it up. It's okay. Alright, let's finish off this side. Now, do I need... You know what? I don't think I do. Sorry guys, but I don't think I need those supports. Because if we're going to leave it... And this might just actually work a bit better. Gonna have it because it's gonna be attached to this here. We should be able to just take these ones out. And put them in like that. And that flushes them up with the the only thing we can't do is we can't get one in here but that can be easily fixed by just knocking out that because we don't need that to be sloped at that point because it's going to be covered up I'm thinking that's a better solution. Because we're going to have the same situation here, I think. Yep, it's not going to let us put one in there. That's okay. work around that. In fact might make a bit more sense in the end. Still only going to bring them out that far at this stage. Eventually we'll have them, we'll have this walkway all the way through between the buildings. empty space. I uh, ran out of blocks, more like it. So no empty block. There's something here. There's nothing there. Won't let me put one in here. It's down there. Nothing.
Now let me put that there, but it won't let me put one in here. Why is that? Uh, it's just underneath here can just be cleared out. Wondering whether I've got a feeling I might have accidentally placed something. Yep, there we go. That's what it is. Alright. So it would have been nice to keep that green, but... I don't know whether we can still do that. Uh, filler, flattener, filler, flattening. That's okay. What we'll do is fruit removal. We'll just do it all the way out here. Just so it's all relatively the same. Not that it's really going to make a huge amount of difference because we're not going to see it except through this stuff. So. Over. Come over. Right. Of course, these ones won't let me put them in because I've got those slope blocks there. can do or can we no we're not going to be able to all right so how are we going to deal with this one probably take that out And replace it just with a normal block, like so. Okay. Like that. All right. So that gives us walkway all the way around. can then do is with our lights we can put a standing light on each of these like so all right not too bad not too bad Yeah, so it's like a central area. There we go, we can see our uh, light on top of our generator room telling us that we've got power. A few lights up here, we still need to do the interior there. But mainly want to get just the overall build done, uh, the basic buildings. Oh, I've got low food. All right. So yeah, happy with that. So all we need to do is just we'll just make sure that all of this is um, the same. So we just uh, use terrain removal on that just to get rid of the grass. Yeah. 
so we've got plenty of food. There we go. Alright. So I think that's where I'm going to call today's uh, video. Uh, so we managed to finish off our generator room and put in part of the walkway or the main walkway. And uh, we'll continue on in the next episode. So I uh, hope you've enjoyed what you've watched. If you have, please leave a like and subscribe. Look forward to seeing you all next time. I'm Ray Zero AU, signing out.